Hi, it's that time of year again. That's right, it's Halloween. And uh, I'm here to teach you how to make a very uh, simple and inexpensive mask out of a jack-o'-lantern. And to do this, I've got uh, some real pumpkins. Um, they have to be quite big, they have to be big enough to fit over your head, so make sure to buy the right ones. So, in a normal jack-o'-lantern, you'd go ahead and open up the top of the pumpkin right here to get it open. But the key to turning a jack-o'-lantern into a mask is actually don't cut right here. That's the last thing you want to do. So what you do is you turn over the pumpkin and this is how you open the pumpkin. You open up through the bottom. So I'm going to cut a hole right here. I'm not being that precise with this hole. I want it in the center of the bottom and ultimately it will be big enough to fit my head but I actually want to open it up really slowly because I don't want it to get too big too fast pop it out and uh, there's the my pumpkin brains so now that I've scooped out uh, almost all the seeds I'm going to use a spoon to scrape out the inside this is a really important step because your head is going inside this thing so you want it as clean as possible on the inside Blah, pumpkin puke <laughs> Now while you're scraping out the inside of your pumpkin also, you want to be very careful of your pumpkin stem because if you put pressure on this, it's going to break. So um, I'm just being very careful uh, not to rest the pumpkin on the pumpkin stem. Now it looks like I've got this most of the way cleaner, at least as clean as it needs to be for now. So the next step is basically I'm going to take this hole, which you can see, not nearly big enough for my head, and I'm going to open it up slowly by cutting around the edge until my head can fit through it. Alright, let's try it out. I don't think my head's going to fit in it, but this is what I like to do. Try and put it on my head. Oh, it's not going yet. It's got to get bigger. Alright, there's my pumpkin opening. Let's see if it fits on my head now. Oh, wow. I've got a pumpkin on my head. So I've got my pumpkin, so it fits over my head. Nice and neat, and uh, there's the front of my pumpkin right there. And now I've got to put the eye holes in. This is the final really tricky part. I'm covered in pumpkin, and i got to warn you, if you're doing this, you got to be comfortable getting covered in pumpkin. It's just, just, just let it on you, it's all right. So um, I'm guessing that my eye holes are here, and I really like to use a skewer or a toothpick or something just to poke little little holes all the way straight through. Now if these holes are in the wrong place, it's not that big a deal. But with this, with these two little holes, I can put it on my head and see where my eyes are that I just pushed through and see if I can see through them. Now I can see a spot of light in both these eyes. So I'm going to put my eyes, the center of my eyes, right about there. So with my eye holes marked right here and here, I'm just going to go ahead and draw a pumpkin jack-o'-lantern. So this is me my jack-o'-lantern face. I'm just going to go ahead and I like to start on the mouth because it's actually the hardest. You can start by cutting really small eyes if you want um, and slowly open them up so that you can be sure they're in the right place. I'm going to put in uh, some eyebrows. I think eyebrows make everything angrier and scarier. A lot of emotion in the eyebrows. Okay. Now my pumpkin head is basically done. Let's try it on and see what it looks like. Whoa, I'm really freaky. So to finish my pumpkin head at costume off, I went and got some farm appropriate clothing. In this case, a uh, white red checkered shirt and some nice comfy pants. And I'm just gonna go ahead and like take a leaf or two and stick them out so they're like bulging out of me. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put on some work gloves. And as you can see, I got a headlamp on and that's gonna illuminate the inside of the pumpkin in your face a bit. Uh, so then just slip on the pumpkin and uh, uh, pumpkin bobblehead. <laughs> and I think I'm pretty scary. Happy Halloween everybody.